You're listening to the Motor Mouth. Well, that's quite an intro. Thank you very much. Well, we're thrilled to be part of with you guys. You know, after that introduction, Motor Mouth, I really don't know what I'm going to say. Motor Mouth Radio is the next is television because they're, they're really good looking guys. <laughs> we were the outlaws from New York, and right, I love that right. line. Motor Mouth. And of course, I thought of you guys right away. Professor Ray, you sound like my wife. Yeah. They want us to have like electric cars that run into people. Uh, I forgot what I was going to talk about. Motor Mouth. I'm still having those brain farts lately. You want to call this guy, he might be very good for your show when you got nobody coming in. Our train staff of two will help. Hey, I hear you are speaking about German cars. It's my man Hans there. Yeah, Hans, it's me. Quite frankly, there are better things to do with your time. If you free yourself from the idea that they have to have perfect pain and be flawless, you get a lot done. That sounds like the cars I drive on the street. My, uh, my remark is going to be strange. Can you use me on your show? Yeah, I want to know what the is wrong with my car. Oh, I can turn around. That's why he's married to me. You guys are dialed into the local community. Vote him out. That's what the car culture is all about. I put a wrench on them and they pop right out. Oh, you're dead now. <laughs> yeah, uh, I know. Right? That's it. I'd be throwing salt over my shoulder, yeah. going chopping the feet off a of rabbit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> there are answers, sometimes correct ones, and we may have them. Motor Mouth Radio, 90.3 FM, WHPC. Vote him out! This is Motor Mouth Radio, your one hour automotive talk show. Alrighty, this is Motor Mouth Radio, your one hour automotive talk show, right here on Long Island. <laughs> I'm Chris Switzer in for Ray Guarino. <laughs> and I just cannot out, you know? <laughs> just can't believe I'm sitting here. And sitting on the doorstep, <laughs> tin cup in hand. And of course, Buddy, can you spare some air condition? This show would not be complete without introducing the co host of this fine establishment, the man who has come down from the mountain. The man who comes down to speak automotively to the townspeople. Oh, come on. I fell out of bed and rolled. Let's cut the crap. The man who is known to the townsfolk is Obi Don Canoli. The man who I have to address anytime I have an automotive problem with, please, can you help me? Oh, Chris, <laughs> you make it sound you make it sound so pathetic. It is it's like, yo, come on, can you give me a hand with this? I'm sweating here. The co-host of this fine show called Motor Mouth Radio, it's Joe D. How are you, my brother? Oh, I'm I'm ecstatic because I finally get to have a little bit of a reunion with uh, my radio mentor. I mean, <laughs> who's Ray, that, Rob? Well, I mean, you actually taught me all that radio stuff. I oh, mean, Ray boy. and I were always the tech guys, but you know that how to speak. Clearly Clearly. Yes, and concisely. And, and concisely. That that was you. As soon as I could figure out how to do it, I'll, I'll gladly let you know. Well, you taught me schming. Schming! And I taught you radio, which is pretty much the same. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, you end up having to wipe it off one way or the other. But uh, that's pretty that's pretty much it. So where's Ray? Someone, 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 someone tells me where's Ray? You know, I was Ray? trying to find the sound clip of the Beverly Hillbillies, because he's off in the... Uh, like one of them Appalachian states there with, you know, <laughs> he's taking banjo lessons from what I understand. I heard he's, he wants to be the king of Tennessee. That's that's what I heard. Yeah, yeah. He's self-appointing himself. Yeah, that and he put had a trailer hitch put on the car so that way he could bring back a, a, a tank or a Jack Daniels Oh, no, wow. You Either know, that or a very old appliance. <laughs> something on someone's porch, I'm assuming. Oh, well, yeah, you know, th that copper, you know, between the copper and the aluminum tubing, you know, how much plumbing you could run in a car, fuel lines, whatever. You know, the Al Alky vehicles or whatever. Whatever. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we, you know, every once in a while we got to catch him a break, you know, and uh, this is one of it. And you, thank God, showed up because that the board over here that that's that thing that looks like the transporter in Star Trek. Yes. I can't, I can't run this thing. Come on, neither can I. I've totally forgotten. I had to get refreshed by Rob. I tried touching it, and my hair actually went back to its old, like, kind of sticky, <laughs> frizzy thing. The ponytail holder is definitely uh, is definitely working overtime it's right now. You know, it's like any given Saturday night for me. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's pretty much it. So, well, I, <laughs> so uh, how is it out in the wilds of Connecticut? Oh my gosh, it is incredibly quiet. Right? 
<laughs> and now you're back here. <laughs> and, and now I'm back here doing this. Yeah. Well, well that's funny. Cause well, that'll Ray, teach you. Well, Ray sent me a, a, an email and said, uh, basically, that he was going Joe away. Joe needs help. Right. He's going away, and either he can play uh, a repeat uh, of you guys, or I can come in and fill in. And I went, I don't like repeats. You know that. I don't like I don't like playing a repeat. So I said, yeah, you don't, you don't even like when I start up. <laughs> so, so, yeah, forget repeats. A whole hour of repeats. So, no, forget it. So I said, no, no, no. I said, all right, I'll do it. And and Ray went, what, what, what? <laughs> he says, he's going to say yes. He's going to do this. Yeah, so you I freaked said, him out over there a little bit, you know? <laughs> so I said, all right. So, yeah, today's another first, too, because we're trying Facebook Live. So. Oh, nice. As a matter hey. of fact, you can see, see the microphone in my eyes. So, and then... And, <laughs> <laughs> There's Chris over there because uh, we're trying all this high tech stuff, and believe me, I am not the right person to be touching this. So, so basically, we're we're really high tech now. Motormouth Radio is super duper high tech, as far as I'm concerned. I lost my piece of paper here. Where? Yeah, you got, oh yeah, yeah, you have paper. Yeah, that's yes. it. Yes, we have motormouthradio dot dot com, and right? that one's not even rolled. Right, we have that, and we have iHeartRadio. Radio. We have Radio dot com. There's, There's a tune in app for yeah. for WHPC. Here. It also links. It, yeah, it links up with the website too. So you know you you Holy know you don't smokes. have you don't have to stand up on the roof with a coat hanger. Yeah, like you know the what old I mean. And, and try to get. I used to have to do that stuff to get you guys when I was a, a, a mere listener, <laughs> or I would have to pull my car in the exact spot in the driveway, or like halfway up the hill, or something <laughs> like. But now you can find this. Live online, or you can catch the recorded shows. You know, just in case uh, it's a little too much on a Sunday. You know, after after uh, after your su- a sufficient cool off period, you want to try going for the uh, you know listening in the comfort and safety of your own living room or whatever. The comfort and safety. Yes, exactly. Relatively <laughs> speaking, because uh, you know sometimes it could be, it, it can be scarring. Mm, it sure you can. know, I mean, after hanging out with you guys for I mean, I don't I don't think I know you guys what like oh, uh, five I've, seven years. I now have found Maron. <laughs> yeah, five seven years. I found a. Um, a CD of a, of a show where you were the guest, and it was 2009. Really? That long ago? That long ago. Oh, the blackouts are getting worse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That 2009. Was, uh, yeah, Howie the Big Man uh, kind uh-huh. of met us up there. Yeah. Exactly. It was two, yeah, 2009. It's amazing how the threads like, of the network come yes, together. Isn't that yes, amazing? Yes, the, the spider web of... It, of, uh, of uh, Inter interrelationships and whatnot. Yes, it's like, hey, I know these guys with a radio show. You want to come on? I'm like, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> oh, ne- you, next thing I know, yeah, it was great because you walked in like you walked in like the most skeptical individual I have ever seen. Like you were like, <laughs> all right, what is going on here? I don't. What is this? I don't, I don't. What is the radio? Who are is, you? Who are you guys? Is, well, yeah, right, exactly. <laughs> who are you guys? You never heard of us, right? And uh, anything that Howie tells you, you probably go, uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, I actually, I actually took that stuff about that's okay. No one's listening. I actually took that literally <laughs> <laughs> so basically after that then the rest is kind of history that is true but you know as far as learning how to uh to, to radio i'm gonna call it to radio right. learning how to radio yes i mean i watched you for a couple of years there and uh you know between uh and, and just kind of watched the back and forth between you and ray which to this day i actually run into people because yeah. people you know, we were talking before about this off air and you asked me if anybody recognized me. I'm like, no, nah, right. not really. And then I'll say something or whatever, you know, hanging out with car people. Like, Are you that guy? <laughs> Are you that guy? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I might be that guy. It depends on which guy you're talking about. Right. <laughs> no, that guy. Not the other guy. That guy. Oh, look, the flashy thing. Uh oh! I'm gonna run behind the shop bench that way you can catch it. All right. We want the shop bench back by you. <laughs> yes, the shop bench. Five one six five seven two seven four four. Zero is the phone number to get a hold of us here at Motormouth Radio. You we remember have... all the numbers. Yes, I'm uh, shocked and amazed. We're going to go to the phones, go to the fun, and say hi. You're on with the Motormouths. Hello, is this Chris? This is. Who am I speaking to? Marilyn. Miss Ma- Marilyn. The clock lady. I missed you so much. Clock. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> I'm good. I was so good to hear your voice. I pulled over. I'm on the side of the road. I had to find shade. Oh, good. We're messing traffic so up now. <laughs> oh, that's oh. great. 
Great. It's great to hear your voice. How have you been? Everything good? I mean, hey, we're just, everything's we're just doing great. Everything's great. I hope that <laughs> you're enjoying, you know, your stuff. I'm still with the diesels. I'm, oh, you know, wow. I have trouble with this that, and that. The and Ford van is still uh, still running? Uh, it's still going, man. That's she, she's going. <laughs> I, you know, it's so funny. <laughs> Thank I can't, God. I can't remember the board, but I do remember you have a Ford diesel van. I mean, that's... After I have a Chevy. Chevy oh, diesel. Chevy. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, Chevy, yeah, yeah, Ford, Chevy diesel. Same stuff. Yeah. yeah. I remember yeah. that thing, sure. You, didn't you have a Ford van? At one time? I did, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, okay. somebody did. No, you ain't Pete that probably big, had a Ford van. All Pete right. has the Ford vans. I have the Chevy van. Okay, because I remember you calling one time about a Ford van. Okay, yeah. that's like very, very well could have been me. And like yes, I said, I'm guilty of all diesels. Ah, uh, but I, like I said, I can't remember trash day. <laughs> can't remember to take the pails out in front of the house. But I remember I who's ca- what cars people have. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> yeah, you walk into a party. Hey, you, you're the guy. You're, you're the lady with the van yeah. there. Yeah, and you had the yeah, yeah, the, the crazy, father. yes, crazy the, lady. <laughs> right, does clocks too. Cuckoo, well, cuckoo. <laughs> Marilyn, it's so good to hear your voice. Thank you so much. Uh, it's good to hear from you too. And you uh, enjoy the day, and I hope you get a lot of good questions to answer. Well, thank you. <laughs> All right. Hopefully, once we can answer. Enjoy your day. Bye. Take bye-bye. care. Bye bye. Five one six. You're what? pulling over people from the road. <laughs> five one six five seven two seven four four zero is phone number to get a hold of the Almighty Joe D and of course myself in for Ray. Yes. So we, 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 yeah, that, I'm sure there are many questions out there. Like, uh, look, we're, you know, we're flashing <laughs> again. Yeah, and, and by the way, I think uh, what, what's Ray doing? He's getting uh, his uh, steel-toed sandals probably resold or something. like That's that? part of it, and uh, basically. It's that and uh, mule training. Mule, tra- <laughs> mule training. Back to the phones. Back to the fun. How you're on with the motor mouths? Chris and Joe D. Yep, yeah. that's us. Awesome. Guilty. Center. Hey, What's welcome up? back for the guest shot. Hey, thank you, Bob. It's good to be back. How are you? I'm well. I had inquired about your departure, and they said you were fine, which is cool. Yes, I was. They're looking at me. It's fun, <laughs> you know, yeah. Um, I'm glad you came back because... Kim was running out of glue to keep that place together. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, man, she must be stressed. Hey, Bob, I meant to ask you, what is yes, the, who was the Motormouth Radio um, Person of the Year? I, I did not uh, get that from you. I okay. thought we, we kind of skated that issue, I, if I remember correctly. Because I do I, listen. <laughs> I, no, I, 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 right. And I had uh, been a little delinquent because I was taking care of some uh, issues in the South. Okay. I had suggested the gentlemen that do... The um, car fair, I think, was at Bald Hill, and all their donations, all, all the all the proceeds went to a charity for, I believe, the Wounded Warrior. Right. Uh, okay. That's that's who I suggested, and um, and I, I stood by it. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, I mean, there was I mean, someone. Guys, you know, I mean, think about that. They they donate all that money. Oh so. no, totally no. I, I, anyone, anyone that does any sort of charitable work, we totally support here, and you know that. And you know, you got to hand it to them because they're taking their own time to do that sort of thing, and it, it's it's always a, a blessing for them. And yes. and we always love to champion that. We like I'm part of this. And Christian, you are part of this. Part to that. Uh, hey, minute. You know, he and Joey D when they get together. With yeah. Ray, I mean, they're just a wealth of information on. Uh, yeah, sure you know, they are on the day. So my question to you is, and I'll leave you with this. Okay. So what I ask every of of all the guests, mm-hmm. what's your current build? Wow. And um, I would say dad bod. Something, mm. Or you're still driving what you had built. Yeah. And uh, have you gotten any speeders up in Connecticut? <laughs> 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 They're brutal up there, man. Let me tell you, when, when I, I drive, I still drive my old police car. And now that it has Connecticut plates on it, it's almost, quote unquote, legitimate. (laughs) Even though I do not, we do not imitate anybody on the road. That's a no, no. Right. But we still, we still drive the the 55 and, and it is so nice (laughs) when people kind of move out of your way. Respect. They do have respect up there, which is, which is, uh, um, something that I pretty much appreciate and cherish. So, but but yeah, it's it's, it's something I like, and I'm I'm still doing it. So it's a good thing. It's a very Great. good thing. Well, look, it's really nice having you back, and I wish you and yours only the best. And uh, thanks for doing the guest shot. Thanks, Bob. That is great. It's great being here, and it's good talking to you. I talk. To, I, I hope to talk to you soon. I wish you well. Bye bye. Right. Take care. Bye bye. Wow, it's getting to be old home week here. Yeah, huh? five one six five seven two seven four four zero. We're playing the old music. I here. know. I'm, I find myself riding. <laughs> <laughs> we're riding over the. Uh, we're talking over the music right now. It's an old, old sort of uh, top forty trick. 
Yes. Talk, talking over the music here. That's that radio stuff. Five one six five seven two seven four four zero. And you know what? Uh, what other malarkey I'm going to bring back? Malarkey. Yes, the Motormouth Radio Honor Group of the Hour. <gasps> I'm going to dust honor. that off too. Right. Yeah. Here it is. If you're part of the Motormouth Radio Honor Group of the Hour, Joe, if you dropped something in your carburetor while the engine was running. <laughs> If, if it popped out of your hand and got sucked in, you're part of the Motormouth Radio Honor Group of the Hour. Now let's see if we can get through this stop set without any major surgery. <laughs>